Hey everyone, the last week or so has been a shambles of bad price management for the government. Not really a good time to be a spin doctor at Downing Street, I suppose. It must feel that after the election you've taken controls of a burning plane and successfully landed on an aircraft carrier that's just been struck by a torpedo. The Grenfell Tower fire was a genuine tragedy, but in the days afterwards, Theresa May came across as detached and unemotional, and she was probably depicted worse in the press than the owner of the company that had illegally installed highly flammable cladding in the first place. It's a bit like if you had a James Bond film where Blofeld came across as a budding entrepreneur and 007 was just a jerk who ran around shooting people and forgetting to pay his bar tab. Jeremy Corbyn, of course, doesn't have to follow through with anything he says now that the election is over, so he's been suggesting all sorts of policy ideas on inequality and social housing and told everyone that on his watch we'd build a gazillion new council homes, all made out of gold, and that everybody affected by the fire would get a free unicorn. And actually, now I think about it, gold is a very low melting point, so hell make the houses out of gingerbread, because at this point it's all academic anyway. Flash forward a few days, though, and a nutter just decided to drive a van into a crowd of Muslims leaving the Finsbury Park Mosque as part of some insane vigilante revenge for the London Bridge attacks a few weeks ago. One of the attackers at London Bridge was wearing an Arsenal shirt mine, so perhaps when the trial starts, this bloke will claim he's not racist, just a Tottenham supporter. For now, though, if you see Theresa May's eyes turning orange, don't worry, just give her a tap on the shoulder, then those eyes will turn to flashing orange, then a flashing green, then a solid green, and boom, the government will have restarted and hopefully gone back to normal. Anyway, see you next week. If you like these, click on the channel to subscribe.